morning everyone it is sunday and yes as you can see the slave look is gone i don't look like i've been singing negro spirituals anymore anyway got my hair done yesterday and you guys know every time i get my hair done there's always something that i don't like about it yeah there's things that i don't like about it but i'm just gonna see if i can fix it when i get home and go from there for the most part though i think it's okay um yeah anyway um what was gonna say today's church i am dressed and today's my birthday happy birthday to me i am 46 years old yes i am don't i look good so this is the back of my hair if you guys want to see and i just have a little clip in it i'm not wearing it completely down because i sweat a lot and yeah i just don't wear my hair completely down unless i have braids which i have not had regular braids for a long time these are crochet braids meaning my hair is braided underneath and then the fake hair is crocheted underneath it so yeah that's my hair for the next um i could probably get by with this maybe three months depending on how well i take care of it so we shall see but it will definitely be done for our vacation which is in 13 days woohoo we're almost down to single digits i'm so excited all right you guys so just wanted to show you my outfit for today for church and ignore the flats i will be putting on heels but there's no reason i have them on now anywho i got this from forever 21 and it's a shirt, but I guess some people would wear it with leggings, but you guys know I don't wear pants. Got it from Forever 21 plus size. This is only the second time I have worn it, and this I think was like $21, so not that bad. Ignore my clothes back there. I need to fold things and put them away. Um, everything is actually... Both of these, remember I told you guys, one side was dirty, one side was clean. I actually washed everything. Everything is clean, and I just need to fold them and put them away, but I've just been lazy, and I just don't want to right now. So I told my kids since vacation is coming up, I honestly do not want them getting me anything for my birthday. They were asking me what I wanted, and I don't want them getting me anything because I want them to save their money for a vacation so we can have a good time. My birthday gift is us enjoying vacation together as a family you know how us mothers are so let's see how well they listen to me they better i don't want them spending a dime on me not a dime so we're home from church and look what i'm eating you guys nothing bunt cake this is so good this is the as you can see red velvet one my kids decided to get me nothing bunt cake for my birthday and my birthday my birthday and this is so good you guys good morning everyone it is monday it's labor day happy labor day everyone what are you guys doing for labor day are you having a barbecue or are you going to the park what are you doing well i was gonna stay home and relax because today is my off day and i was gonna relax watch movies all day long or netflix or youtube our church has an annual picnic. We have two picnics a year, usually on Memorial Day and Labor Day weekend. And I wasn't gonna go because I'm like, this is my one focus. I'm like, this is my one Monday or whatever that I get to, one holiday that I get to sleep in and not have to worry about doing anything. So I went back and forth. At first I wasn't gonna go, then I wasn't gonna go. Then I changed my mind again. So I don't know, I think I may just go not stay long to show my face stay maybe a couple of hours i really don't want to be out that long it's from like 11 to 5 and is that a different park i've never been to this park before so i'm just starting to slowly get ready but i think i better hurry up because it's from 11 to 5 and even though i'm pretty sure i'm going to be late not too late i still have to go to the store to get like chips and dip or something to bring because like I said I was not planning on going so I didn't get anything I'm actually uploading videos and I'm scheduling them for when we go on vacation because I'm not gonna have a video every day more you guys when we go on vacation but maybe every other day or something like that just so you guys can have something um, but I brought the laptop in the bathroom. It's right here. I can't show you guys because it has the title and where we're going. But um, I don't know. For some reason, the connection is better right here. So the day we leave, which is going to be September 15th, I have this like 
cutesy little reveal video. I think you guys will enjoy it. So I scheduled that um, last night, and now today I'm scheduling one that's going to go up on Sunday, September 16th. So you guys will see that too. And then I may have one or two more throughout that week that I'll put up. The way you guys will have something until we come back. Normally for the picnics, you guys, I invite someone. I know last picnic, Memorial Day, I invited Melissa and her family. And I didn't do that this time because I honestly was not planning on going. And I didn't want to invite someone and me feel obligated on going because I'm serious. My mom was going back and forth whether or not I should go. And I'm just letting the water get hot so I can wash my face. In case you're wondering, I literally decided this morning that, okay, let me just go. I don't use anything on my face besides sea breeze, you guys. And actually, this is going to be my liquid gold when I go on vacation. This usually clears up my acne. I don't get acne often unless it's around that time of month. But when I do, I gotta get something for it. All right, let's get this hair done. So at night, I put it in two ponytails like Pocahontas <laughs> and put my scarf on. It looks crazy. As you guys know, this is, um, what am I saying? This is synthetic hair, if you didn't know, now you know. And if I just try to sleep on it without a scarf or anything like that, it would be so nappy and matted and I would look like a hot mess. And sometimes, just in case you wanted to know, um, when I have this in my hair, I would use mousse. So it's this one right here. But I don't use this often because if you use too much, it makes it really heavy and it gets like this film over it. Can't explain it. I learned that lesson the hard way. So just mousse and I don't do this every day, but I use it for the first couple days sometimes just because when I first get my hair done, it's kind of like a lion's mane and this tames it. So so I don't know if I'll go back to her again for this hair. It doesn't look bad. However, I think the way she installed it, it's shedding a lot. And it shouldn't shed at all. I don't think she... I should not have this much hair coming out at the ends. By the time it's time for me to take this out, I will have no... <laughs> I feel like I will have no um, hair in there. Now if this would stay like this, I would leave it because it's actually kind of cute. But I don't really like hair all in my face and whatever like that because I sweat too much. So that's the reason why the majority of the time I put my weed up when I get it done. Even though this is not a weed, y'all know what I'm saying. And I still haven't put my clothes away. Um, it may or may not happen one day this week. We shall see. All right. I like leaving a few strands out. I'm weird, I know, but everyone has their certain ways that they like having their hair done, so. And this is mine. Hope this upload is done by the time I leave, but probably not. Actually, I'm going to need a little bit more at the top because it's looking a little frizzy. And see, I don't like the way it's tied at the scalp because it looks nappy to me. So, yeah. It sucks when you have someone to do your hair and you use that person for a long time and then you have to find someone else because they're not doing it right so yeah that's the dilemma that I'm stuck with now every time I pull some of this hair in the back and probably say well don't do it well I can't help it 
like a scab when you get it you can't help picking at it and I know it's not just the hair because I've had this in my hair before and maybe like the first day you get it in a little bit comes out because you know they cut it or they I don't know what those called but it's like scissors with jagged edge to make it to thin it out they'll use that and so then you know you'll get there that comes out from that or you know you you can try to pick it out or whatever but this is every time I do this I get here and that's not good wash my hands but this hair stuff is really like not sticky but it just leaves a film on your hands like it does your hair if you put too much on it. So probably tomorrow I won't be putting any in. It is almost 10 o'clock and apparently it's much later. We had fun at the park actually. I stayed longer than I planned on because we played some games and kind of forgot I, me and Savannah volunteered to facilitate the games. So we played, well they played Fuzzy Bunny with the marshmallows and they played What's In My Mouth Challenge and they also had a watermelon eating contest and that was actually funny that was what you guys seen um in the clip before i only recorded a little bit of it but yeah um it was actually pretty fun pretty funny it was not that hot today i mean it was hot but it wasn't that bad so shine and tariq had to work that's the reason why they were not at the picnic so it was just savannah and i and I don't know, Evie had plans to do something else, I don't know. So yeah, we stayed there. It was from 11 to 5. We got there maybe about 11.30, 11.45, and we stayed till almost 4. I honestly did not plan on staying that long, but anyway, so we came home and I showered and we started watching things on YouTube. I'm still trying to edit and upload videos for the week that we're on vacation so yeah you guys i am tired i don't know what's on this video i don't know if it's going to be very long at all but i think i'm going to end it here thank you so much for watching do me a favor before you leave please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already and i will see you guys in the next video